David Hinden and I'm an ASO product specialist. I'm here today to demonstrate how to unbox the Durovision FDF2382 touch panel monitor. This monitor ships with a UK power cable, a DVI cable, a display port cable, a USB uplink cable and an audio cable. Remove the polystyrene and place to one side. Carefully place one hand on the rear stand of the monitor using your other hand to help stabilize the unit. Ensure that you do not place any undue pressure on the LCD panel. Carefully remove the protective bag. The tilt stand allows adjustment between 15 and 70 degrees, allowing the monitor to be used in an upright or near horizontal mode. The monitor is equipped with the following ports, a headphone jack, an audio input jack, a VGA video connection, a DPI video connection, a display port video connection, two USB downstream ports to connect peripheral devices such as keyboards, and a USB upstream port to connect the touch functions to the connected workstation. And on the opposite side of the monitor, you can find the power connector and power rocker switch. On the right hand side of the monitor, you can find the touch on off switch, the on screen display menu buttons, and the power on off switch. Connecting your Durovision FDF2382 is a quick and easy task. First, connect your signal cables. Here, we are using the DisplayPort video connection. Press the connector home, ensuring that it clicks into place. Connect the video cable to your workstation. Attach the USB Type-B connector to the monitor, like so. Connect the USB Type-A connector to the workstation. If using an alternative video connector, connect your audio cable. And on the opposite side of the monitor, you can find the power connector and power rocker switch. Once all your connections have been made, ensure the rocker switch to the rear of the monitor is in the on position. Then hit the power button to the side of the monitor. Your image will then be displayed. 